feel honoured, Rupert. I don't normally show people my training routine, especially when I'm getting ready for a big power walk. You have no idea how much this means to me, Mr Ultrawalk. I've dreamed of this day since I first heard of you. <laughs> oh yes, well, just remember our agreement. Yeah, I know. Stick to the restraining order. Until you show me your training routine. Atta boy. Now, we're going to start off with some basic stretching exercises. Now, as you know, it's very important to stretch for any kind of big workout. Otherwise, you risk your muscles contracting, and that can lead to a stretch-induced coma. But, but Mr Ultrawalk, why don't you just join a gym? Surely that would be better to have professional equipment than what you can find in this simple park. Gyms are for wusses and lesbians, okay? You see, Rupert, Mother Nature is the best training facility, with the incredible wildlife giving me the inspiration I need, and the silent yet smooth breeze of the wind cooling me down, and the soft and tender grass making me comfortable. Plus, membership fees are bullshit. Okay, stretches. So beautiful. And now we move on to our next piece of uh, extensive equipment. The bench! You see, this tool may be man-made, but it has coincided with Mother Nature since the dawn of time. Even cavemen use rocks as benches to sit, but I found another use for it, you see. I can build up my arm strength, increasing my stamina in my arms. Observe. Incredible, Mr. Ultrawalk. Yes, well, I am quite incredible. <laughs> now, the final part of my routine is attempting to climb this lamppost. Now, I've never actually been able to do it, but I find that attempting to do so builds up the strength in my arms and my legs, thus balancing out the energy levels in my entire body. Now, step back, Rupert. This. Come on, step back. This is going to get ugly. You can do it! <sighs> Once again, I've failed. But my strength has grown. Now come on, it's time to do the power walk. 